There's a lot more to Tillamook than meets the cheddar. Do you know the meaning behind their lovable ship logo? Or that they're winners of the World Cheese Championship? Stay tuned to find out some tasty untold truths. Tillamook's Top Shelf Curd is the product of the Tillamook County Creamery Association, a dairy cooperative that today is the largest employer in Tillamook County, an economic engine empowering nearly 900 people in the craft of fine dairy. While years of small-time dairy farming offered decent income, it wasn't until local dairy farmers formed the Tillamook Cooperative in 1909 that they truly entered their stride. The Tillamook County Creamery Association started simply. They welcomed 10 independent dairy farmers who only had to pay a $10 entry. Fee. Today, that co-op belongs to 80 farmer owners and has propelled the Tillamook County Creamery Association into a top 50 American cheesemaker. Tillamook's commitment to quality and teamwork also shows up in their long-standing record of integrity, as the cooperative has held a constant commitment to stewardship, both to the Tillamook County community and to their customers. Before the cooperative could take off, the Tillamook County dairy farmers first had to solve their distribution issues. Prior to refrigerated cars, time was a factor in transporting perishable dairy. Given the lack of freeway infrastructure, the fastest route to Oregon's biggest city, Portland, was via water. So the people of Tillamook County came up with a plan, build a ship specifically a schooner that was dubbed the Morning Star. The ship build was a success, and ironically enough, the Morning Star became the first ship built in Tillamook County and registered in Oregon. This ship is such a staple of Tillamook's history that a full-size replica of the schooner sits on display at the Tillamook Creamery's main factory. The richly specific taste of Tillamook traces back to a partnership with a genius cheese artist. When Canadian cheesemaker Peter McIntosh migrated to Tillamook County, he brought an artisanal arsenal of cheese crafting knowledge with him. He consistently refined a promising cheddar formula, and all he needed was a chance to prove his expertise as he wanted a cheesemaking plant of his own. Luckily for the lactose tolerant, Tillamook gave him that opportunity. In 1894, McIntosh was hired to operate Tillamook County's first commercial cheese plant. He taught Tillamook dairy farmers everything he knew. In 1909, the Tillamook County Dairy Cooperative rewarded McIntosh's ingenuity, incorporating his popular cheese-making formula as their standard winning recipe. This is all thanks to the cheese king of the coast spreading his gospel of cheese throughout the Tillamook Valleys. If Tillamook County dairy farmers were committed enough to build Oregon's first ship and actually sail it, imagine how great their cheese could be. I thought we'd take a brief moment to celebrate one of life's greatest gifts. Bolder, better, Tillamook cheddar. The world didn't wait long for that answer, as Tillamook County's first big culinary victory came at the 1904 World's Fair in St. Louis. Ten years into McIntosh's influence, the World Fair paved the way to McIntosh's work and Tillamook's merging as one. It also paved the way to Tillamook becoming a full cooperative. As their products continued to improve and expand, working together with other dairy farmers became both lucrative and essential. Cheese does not get taken lightly in Wisconsin, so for all intents and purposes, if your cheese can win here, it can win anywhere. And that's what Tillamook did. In 2010, their mild cheddar obliterated the competition, scoring 99.6 out of 100 points at the World Cheese Championship in Wisconsin. Not only did Tillamook wrest the championship belt from the cheese-obsessed Midwest, their mild cheddar variety bested all 59 competitors in the category. You can add in some artificial flavoring, sure. which we do not do. Yellow rubber duckies have always been popular with the little ones, but what about yellow rubber cows? Tillamook's squeaky toy cow, Tilly, was a fan favorite from day one. This friendly cow with a sweeping, joyful smile captured mascot status and held that mantle for over 50 years. Now discontinued as their solo brand ambassador, the original Tilly of Tillamook rubber squeak toy remains a lucrative antique at online auctions and Pinterest boards. Original Tillies fetch far over their original prices, with mint condition Tillies still housed in their rustic farm farmland packaging. Periodically, newer editions of Tilly are on sale at the Tillamook factory. Peace, love, cheese? In the summer of 2010, all three were on the table as the Love Loaf Tour hit over 100 U.S. cities in a fleet of cheddar orange Volkswagen minibuses. Spreading the message of their love of dairy, Tillamook commemorated their 100th anniversary by slinging free samples and coupons to supermarkets and outdoor displays wherever their cheese loaves on wheels roamed. The stunt was a huge success. As a follow-up, Tillamook launched their Dairy Done Right campaign in 2015, where they published a series of scintillating photos of melted cheeses on hot food. This is the way. 
This is the way. Tillamook has stood for quality since they could stand on their own, and since their inception, they've refused to take shortcuts. As a matter of pride, Tillamook has always aged their cheddar naturally for as long as it takes. It can take anywhere from three months to as long as five years in some cases. To anyone who's tasted the creamier difference, the difference is obvious. It was a no-brainer when we were thinking about what we were going to put in our truck. It was Tillamook. People just love it. Every rich variety of Tillamook dairy packs that penchant for quality. Every bite provides a taste that is genuine. Tillamook's integrity remains self-evident and far-reaching. In 2020, when many farmers hit the skids due to pandemic-related shortfalls, Tillamook stepped up. They vowed to contribute 10% of their September profits to their aid. All in all, Tillamook donated $1.6 million to the American Farmland Trust, a national nonprofit organization dedicated to protecting farmland and keeping farmers on their land. In addition to this generous contribution, Tillamook further committed $100,000 to restaurant chefs whose businesses were hit hard by the COVID-19 pandemic. This should come as no surprise. Since its inception, the Tillamook County Creamery Association has made stewardship a top priority. We want to make a real impact. For us, that means supporting the people and the places that have supported us for more than a century. Today, the Tillamook Co-op publicly lists its top six stewardship commitments proudly. They commit to thriving farms, healthful cows, inspired consumers, enduring ecosystems, fulfilled employees, and enriched communities. As a top 50 dairy provider in America, the Tillamook Creamery is capable of flexing some solid infrastructure. They boast factories that are able to produce 167,000 pounds of cheese every day. Within a single massive warehouse, Tillamook can age 50 million pounds of cheese at a single time. Yes, the number is barely comprehensible. That's a lot of cheese. Yet, it's a reality that's allowed Tillamook to enjoy life on dairy's top shelf from coast to coast. In fact, the warehouse itself is so massive and magnificent, it's become a tourist attraction all by itself. Not only are tourists awed by Tillamook's mind-boggling cheese-producing capacity, they're also taken behind the curtain and shown how it's all made possible. Each year, nearly one million people pass through the creamery on self-guided tours. These tours give people a chance to witness the magic of how Tillamook's impeccable products are formed, processed, and packaged. Tourists even learn about the secret ingredient that gives Tillamook cheddar its distinctive orange hue as they step through the company's history. The self-guided tours of Tillamook Creamery allow you to explore the bounds of their barn-like factory. A tour of their ice cream making process is also available, and if you ask the kids, it may be Tillamook County Creamery's number one attraction. Check out one of our newest videos right here! Plus, even more mashed videos about your favorite brands are coming soon. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the bell so you don't miss a single one.